I N E R T I A. This word is pronounced inertia. In everyday terms, it is defined as the tendency of an object to keep its velocity constant. Here is the first thought demonstration. When a ball is thrown, after its release, it keeps going despite no hand touching it anymore. Here is another thought experiment. When you walk with regular shoes on concrete, you need to keep your legs moving to move forward. But to move forward on ice, after initial pushes, with skates, you do no longer have to keep your legs moving to keep moving. Notice this player even turned around and then kept on sliding in the initial direction he was going. This tendency to keep constant velocity is described by Newton's first law of motion. An object at rest will remain at rest and an object in motion will remain in a constant state of motion unless acted upon by a net outside force. Colloquially, this is referred to as the law of inertia. Take a look at two key phrases here. Constant state of motion refers to constant velocity, meaning both speed and direction are maintained. Net outside force will be discussed more in detail in the topic of Newton's second law. As a preview of net outside force and its importance, consider the common phrase, pulling yourself up. Physically speaking, this is impossible. Forces internal to a system cannot accelerate it. Consider the legend of German folk hero Baron von Münchhausen. In one of his tales, he tells a story how he was riding a horse through a swamp when the horse started sinking. The Baron bragged that he was so strong that he merely pulled on his own hair and on the horse to lift both of them out of the swamp. Keep in mind 
the definition of Newton's first law as well as the demonstrated thought experiments when you move on to the topic of Newton's second law.